Bull Mastiff is a large-sized domestic dog of the Mastiff type. Heavy and strong, the Bull Mastiff was originally bred to defend and guard against poaching. They were developed in England by hunters to be courageous, confident, robust, and fast dogs. These guys have a reputation for being fearless at work, yet docile at home. Also known as the silent watchdogs, Bull Mastiffs are mellow canines that make great apartment companions. Now without further ado, let's dive right into our list of top 10 interesting facts about the Bull Mastiff. But before we start our list, we'd like to take a moment to express our thanks to all the original Bull Mastiff owners on this video. The video would seriously not have been possible without them. So don't forget to check out these incredible dogs from their Instagram profiles that have been linked in the description below. And now, let's begin the list. Number 1. Their History The Bull Mastiff is a relatively new breed developed in the mid-1800s to track down poachers and hold them down. Gamekeepers developed the breed for strength, size, and speed by crossing the Bulldog of the 19th century with the Mastiff. The Mastiff was large but not aggressive enough, and the Bulldog was tenacious but lacked in size. As a result, Bull Mastiffs became the perfect combo and became known as the Gamekeeper's Night Dog. Poaching eventually declined, so people started using them as guard dogs. Dog fanciers began breeding them as a distinct breed rather than a crossbreed since the early 20th century. England's Kennel Club recognized the breed in 1924, followed by the American Kennel Club in 1933. Number 2. Their Appearance Bull Mastiffs are big dogs with males reaching 25 to 27 inches in height and weighing around 110 to 130 pounds. Their large, broad head highlights their dark eyes, V-shaped ears, and broad, deep muzzle. The compact body has a deep chest and well-developed shoulders. The tail usually sets low and is either straight or slightly curved, hanging down to the level of the hocks. Bull Mastiffs are covered with short, glossy, dense coats that provide proper protection against rain, snow, and cold. Both the coat and the color can vary a lot depending on the dog's appearance. Some dogs have a smooth texture while others have more of a bristle one. The coat comes in three colors, red, fawn, and brindle, although it may also include a combination of these colors. Occasionally, these mastiffs also come with a small white mark on their chest. Number 3. They are Brachycephalic Brachycephalic describes any dog whose muzzle looks like it has been flattened or squashed inwards. Their bottom jaw is disproportionately longer than their upper jaw, and the dog may look as though their lower jaw sticks out. Brachycephalic obstructive area syndrome, also known as the Brachycephalic syndrome, is common in flat-faced dogs. The ability to breathe normally is commonly a struggle for dogs with this syndrome. Bull Mastiffs have a flat face and a short muzzle, which is why these dogs are prone to this syndrome. However, it's not common for these dogs to have any breathing issues compared to other flat-faced breeds such as pugs. Experts have suggested that with the right amount of care, these dogs can enjoy a normal lifespan without any serious breathing complications. Nevertheless, bull mastiffs are prone to heat exhaustion and heat stroke, so they should be kept indoors during hot or humid weather. Number 4. They are reliable dogs. Bull Mastiffs are fearless and confident, yet obedient to their humans. They are smart and reliable dogs that make a natural guardian of their home and family. And while these dogs have a laid-back attitude with family members, that changes when a stranger enters the picture. They tend to be suspicious of anyone outside the family. If they feel threatened, these dogs will respond instantly. They can be territorial at times and will make sure of their size to defend against any perceived threat. Bull Mastiffs are also good with children, but they might have a hard time getting along with other pets especially of the same sex. For this reason, bull mastiffs should be socialized with other animals at an early age. Number 5. They don't bark or bite Contrary to their large appearance, bull mastiffs don't bite. Also, they're not yappy or overly vocal, and they're calm in the face of any situation. This makes them different from other traditional guard dogs. However, when they're around strangers, these dogs tend to be a little more defensive. Bull mastiffs are naturally protective of their family and property, and when they feel threatened, they'll react immediately by barking or growling. This breed was trained not to bark or bite intruders, but to silently track, pin, and hold them. They retain these instincts even after their roles shifted to being family companions. So when you're told that the dog does not bite, you can be at ease if it's a bull mastiff. Number 6. They don't need much exercise Bull Mastiffs are low-energy dogs and they don't need as much exercise as you'd think. They would rather lounge around in their own backyard or at home on their favorite couch. However, short exercise sessions can help keep your dog content and healthy. The daily dose of exercise that these dogs need is a walk, which can be extended to hiking if they are up for it. This can be further supplemented by a game of fetch or frisbee. But remember that playing frisbee is only for dogs with great recall, as the other dogs might end up running after it and never come back. Moreover, these dogs are not suitable for runners, but they are great walking companions. Playing outside is one of their favorite pastimes, but fencing is crucial. 
Number 7. They have some bad habits. Similar to their distant relative the pug, bull mastiffs drool a lot, and they're known to slobber when they're excited. The drooling can be quite extreme, especially when eating or drinking, as well as when they're feeling anxious or excited. With that said, drooling is nothing to worry about as long as you're able to groom your dog regularly. Bull mastiffs also tend to snort, grunt and snore loudly, especially while sleeping. This can get bothersome if you're not used to it. Bull mastiffs can also be prone to gassiness. If wiping up drool and loud snoring bothers you, this is not going to be the breed for you. Moreover, if not appropriately socialized, your bull mastiff can also get aggressive towards other pets, so make sure to train and socialize them well as pups. Number 8. Some Famous Bull Mastiffs Bull Mastiffs have managed to gain a quieter reputation for themselves because of their friendly and affable personality. Their gentle, calm, and laid-back nature makes them a popular choice for families. Bull Mastiffs rank 40th among 157 breeds and varieties registered by the AKC. Aside from that, there are also some Bull Mastiffs in particular that have gained fame. Butkus, the pet of actor Sylvester Stallone, was a Bull Mastiff and was also featured in the movie Rocky. Marlon Brando, Christina Aguilera, Michael Bay, and Bon Jovi have all owned Bull Mastiffs. Swagger, yet another Mastiff, is even the live mascot of the Cleveland Browns from the NFL. Number 9. They're grooming. Bull Mastiffs don't shed heavily, so a quick daily brushing will keep their coat clean and shiny. Your Bull Mastiff can be bathed weekly up to every 6 to 8 weeks depending on their activity level and lifestyle. Brush their teeth daily and trim their nails once or twice a month. While grooming, examine your dog for any sores, injuries, or infections. Check and clean their ears for infection at least once every week. Take note of any excessive odor in their ears as that can be a sign of infection. Also check for signs of ear mites and ticks. Number 10. Their Health The Bull Mastiff's common health problems include hip and elbow dysplasia, hypothyroidism, eye problems, heart defects, and bloat. A common use of disease faced by the breed is panostitis. It is often misdiagnosed as dysplasia or patellar luxation and may lead to unnecessary surgery. If signs like lameness occur in your Mastiff, it's wise to get a second opinion from an orthopedic specialist. To ensure that your bull Mastiff remains healthy throughout most of her life, make sure to get a pup from a certified breeder who can provide you with the pup's parents' health clearances. And don't forget to make a visit to the vet every once in a while for the checkup. Alright folks, that's it for our list of top 10 interesting facts about the Bull Mastiff. Thank you so much for watching the video. If you already own one of these silent watchdogs, we'd love to know what it's like to have one and the household. Hit us up in the comments below. Please leave a like if you enjoyed the video and share it with your friends and family as well. For more interesting facts about different dog breeds, click on our channel and don't forget to subscribe. See you guys in the next one.